Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. I'm going to show you a premium plugin that is a sound designer's dream. So welcome to a blank screen inside Adobe Audition. First of all, I'm going to start by generating some lovely effects that you can do inside Adobe Audition. Uh, so we'll go for, let's go for some white noise in this window here. Then I'm going to start a new file right here and go to effects. I'm going to generate a nice tone here. That'll do nicely, one kilohertz tone. And I might go ahead and uh, actually I'll go ahead and record uh, something as well. Let's make sure this is armed to record uh, to the correct microphone. That'll do. I'll do it into this microphone here. Bang. Ah! Okay, just a few little effects we can have a play with in the multi-track. Create a new multi-track session. And I've got my white noise here. I've got my tone here. And I've got my silly vocal sound effects here. Now we're going to make them totally different using a great plugin called isotope stutter edit it's a vst3 plugin that you can get from the isotope website uh, and it can do so much uh, you can actually set this up to work in adobe audition by getting this box up arming a new track to record and as you can see at the moment it's recording my microphone so you change the input from your default input uh, to hopefully on your audio interface you have a loop back which records what you hear from the computer that's what you want so now you'll see when i play this audio if I play and record, it's actually recording what it hears from the computer. That's what we want. Now, inside Stutter Edit, uh, it works best with a MIDI keyboard in a, uh, a, a music editing door. But of course, if you want to use it here in Adobe Audition to do some great sound design, you can do that with a preset manager. Here are your presets. Here is your MIDI keyboard. You just hit record and you can start playing the keys to generate different sounds. And they will sound completely different to this or this or this. Ah! Okay, let's see what we come up with. Ready? Let's go. And there we go. Stop. Finish. I've been playing my MIDI keyboard there inside Stutter Edit. Cool, cool plugin for manipulating audio. And now you will see on track two, I have recorded a whole bunch of effects that I can cut down and use in sound design, even in my own radio imaging product projects. I mean, this is just fantastic. Just in the space of recording for, look there, 30 seconds, I have a bunch of stuff. So uh, let's have a listen again. And now if I want to, I can actually take something. I love that. I think that's brilliant. <laughs> You'd never know that's me screaming, would you? I can actually take these now and I can double them up onto different tracks like so and like so. Uh, and then what we might do is we might do a little bit of panning to either side. You could go nuts. You could EQ as well. See how this sounds. Okay, brilliant. And then we could mix that down. So go into effects and, uh, sorry, multi-track, mix down the time selection there. And there it is. We might go into effects, special, and master it to give it a nice polished sound. And we're left with this wonderful sound design effect. <laughs> Now, I'm not sure how you would use that in your production, but you can see the creative possibilities will drive any audio producer's mind absolutely wild. It's called Stutter Edit. It's a paid plugin from Isotope, and you can download a free trial from their website. Link will be in the description to this video.